G'day everyone, uh, here we are in house tying sessions this week. I'm gonna run you through a really simple damsel that works very well in Australia and I caught fish during my Commonwealth sessions on Curatao on it. Super simple, super quick to tie and really, really effective. So you can tie them on a lot of different sizes but this one we're gonna tie on a size 12 302 Daihiku. I'm gonna use some three mil uh, metallic green beads. You need some small green wire, and some olive marabou and some thread to put it all together. So I'm just going to lay a bit of thread across the shank of the hook. I'm going to go all the way back to about halfway along the point of the hook. All right, I just want to select my marabou feather. Now there's heaps of feathers in the pack, but you want one that's nice and fluffy so it has really good movement. And you also need it to be long enough that you can tie the body of your fly with it as well as the tail. So just pick one that's going to be suitable. And then just grab a bunch of it. Now it doesn't actually matter whether all the tips are even because I will trim them once I've put it onto the hook. So I'm just going to sit it on there. And I'm gonna go worst case scenario with my tips. So these slightly longer ones I can pinch off to make it the right length. And then I also want that front part of the fly, uh, the front part of the marabou across the front of the fly, because that's what I'm gonna use for my body. So it's super quick, super simple tie. Now I'll put my wire on there. Just gonna attach the wire in. Now I need to bring that thread right up to the back to lock the wire in. And once I've done that, I can bring it forward. And our next step is to twist our marabou together, which will create the body of the fly. So I'm just gonna wrap that in even wraps. Just hold it down there, all the way to the front of the fly. Now I do know that this is a rotary vise but I find that I have much more control wrapping it with my fingers. I get a better result that way. So now I can just trim that little bit off there. Now I can wrap my wire in. And that's just there as a rib. I use green because it sort of matches in with a fly, but I think it's more there just to hold the fly together. Do that and we can trim off the wire. Make sure the body's all nice. I can whip finish the head. Once that's done, trim that off and then we can select the tail length that we want. We want a little bit of movement but we don't want it too long so just pinching the end together with my fingers and thumb and that finishes the fly off. A little bit of head cement, it's all done. Very quick simple tie and I think all of the best flies are like that because you can tie up enough you need in very little time and they're super effective. 